Hi everyone and welcome back to the English Danny channel. I'm teacher John and I'm here to help you become great at learning English. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and if you really like this video, turn on notifications so you know if we publish any more videos in the future. Let's get started. All right, so today's topic is very interesting, I think, all right? So make sure you stick around to the end of the video for a very useful English tip, all right? Our topic today is you and I versus you and me. So uh, these two phrases, they're very similar, but they are different, all right? And this is a mistake that, yes, many students make this mistake, but also many native English speakers also make this mistake and they are confused by which phrase to use correctly. All right, so let's try. All right, let's use it in a sentence and let's look at the correct way to use it. All right, so first let's look at these two sentences. All right, which sentence do you think is correct? A, you and me will go to a restaurant tomorrow. Or B, you and I will go to a restaurant tomorrow. Well, the correct answer is B, you and I will go to a restaurant tomorrow. All right, and let's take a look at another, uh, another example, another question. All right, again, which sentence do you think is correct? A. Excuse me, will you take a picture of my wife and I? Or B. Excuse me, will you take a picture of my wife and me? The answer is B. All right, we use the, the pronoun me in this spot. All right, so now let's talk about why. Why are these two um, words confused and what should we do? Well, the answer is very simple, okay? I is a subject pronoun and me is an object pronoun. So there's a very simple rule here. We need to use the correct pronoun, okay? If, if we're talking about the subject, then we need to use I. If we're talking about the object, then we need to use me. See, very simple. But let's talk about some examples and see how we can use it and get some practice in. All right, so now we're back to uh, our first example, okay? Uh, if you can remember. And let, let's talk about this a little bit and let's talk about why this answer a is incorrect, okay? All right, so you and me here is the subject. It's the subject of the sentence, all right? So <clears throat> this answer is incorrect. It's not correct, all right? Because me is an object pronoun. So it cannot be used to describe the subject. All right, and here B is the correct answer, all right? You and I will go to a restaurant tomorrow, okay? Here's the subject, you and I, okay? I is a subject pronoun, so it can be used to describe the subject. All right, now let's take a look at our other example here, which is, excuse me, will you take a picture of my wife and I? Okay, here, my wife and I is the object. Okay, so I is a subject pronoun, so it cannot be used to describe the object. So A is 
not correct. And here, B, excuse me, will you take a picture of my wife and me? My wife and me is the object. All right, me is the object pronoun, so it can be used to describe the object. All right, and here is a useful tip for you, okay? Try removing the pronoun you and see if the sentence makes sense after that, all right? So, for example, you and I will go to a restaurant tomorrow. Let's remove the pronoun you and and. Okay, let's remove them. So now we're left with I will go to a restaurant tomorrow. Hmm. Does that make sense? Is that correct? Yes. So you and I is also correct. No problem. All right. And then here, the other example, we have you and me will go to a restaurant tomorrow. Well, again, let's remove the pronoun you and and here let's remove them all right now we're left with me will go to a restaurant tomorrow hmm does that make sense no no we can't speak like that in english that's not okay so then you and me will go is incorrect it is not correct all right everyone thanks so much for watching uh, if you like that video please give give us a thumbs up like the video and uh, also subscribe if you're not already a subscriber all right i'll see you next time on the english danny channel